Hi, this is Miss Caroline, your STEM teacher, and here's my helper, Joe. Hello. Since it's springtime, we are going to focus on flowers this week. This week's STEM challenge is, can you make a flower imprint? In order to do this challenge, you're going to need a flower, some petals, a thin fabric. We don't have any fabric, so we're going to use a coffee filter. A piece of paper, we're just using computer paper, and some blocks that we're going to use as a hammer. So if you have anything that you can use to pound your flour with, that'll be fine too. The first thing you need to do is to pick off a few petals from your favorite plant. Joe, how many flowers? Do you have on our paper? I'm going to do three. Okay. We're just going to kind of separate them a little bit and flatten them with our fingers just to help for when we make our imprint. The next thing you need to do is to get your thin fabric or your coffee filter and place it on top of your petals. Perfect. And then like I said, in order to pound the um, colors off of the flower, we're going to use these blocks. It's been a few minutes pounding on each individual flower until you start to see the dyes come through the coffee filter. Okay, when you're finished, remove your coffee filter and carefully take off any flowers that remain on the filter. And you have your perfect flower imprints left over on your fabric or on your coffee filter. I hope you enjoy making flower imprints. Have a great rest of your week. I'll see you next week. Bye.